ask almost anyone walking the streets of downtown Kannapolis and they'll tell you this town wouldn't be what it is today if not for the Earnhardts. The family leaving behind a big impact on the town where its matriarch Martha Earnhardt lived and raised five children. The name Earnhardt is very important in, in NASCAR okay, and uh, in the community it's just immense. So. Uh, you telling me that Ms. Uh, Ms. Earnhardt had passed away was a shock. Martha Earnhardt passed away Christmas Day at the age of 91. She was preceded in death by her three sons, including Dale Sr., who died in 2001 when his race car crashed at the Daytona 500. Dale Earnhardt's legacy in racing of, of being determined uh, to make it happen no matter what. He didn't come from money, he just, he made it happen. My grandfather-in-law uh, grew up with him and, uh, you know, they were, they were very Christian-oriented. Here in downtown Kannapolis, there's a plaza dedicated to Dale Earnhardt Sr. We're told his mom enjoyed frequent walks here to remember her son. My wife is a postal worker here and she delivered mail to her and she just would you know, it was just, she was just a regular person. You could be nice to her and she'd be nice back. In a statement, the city of Kannapolis said Martha was a treasured member of our community. If you dropped by her home, you were always welcomed as if you were one of her family members that she loved so dearly. She was the woman who raised the legends. In Kannapolis, Indira Esquiva, WCNC Charlotte.